For Nick and I, it was just like an adrenaline rush, and soon everyone would feel our excitement, and some will endure Aaron's fear. As we returned home, it was as if we were entering back into a new era in time. Even living in such a fast-paced modern society, think about the paranormal and resistance of ghosts. How would they react when one of the most controversial and strongest pieces of evidence supporting their existence is broadcast to them on live television? I don't know what we're looking at right now, but if you look at the monitor, what is that that we're looking at? That is the most shocking piece of evidence yes. that we captured. Now the people watching this interview are going, yeah, right. <laughs> okay, then I'm going to tell everybody that's watching this right now that the apparition sequence, we can guide you through that actual clip and tell you why it is real. This time, it wasn't a personal experience. This time, there were three of us who were there and knew this was real. And other news stations broadcast their claim. There are ghosts roaming the Nevada desert, at least that's what a new documentary says, and the two men who made it say they can prove the claim to anyone who gives them the chance. When you first saw the footage of the unexplained apparition figure following you, how did you react? I was freaked out because I knew, because I was the only one in this ballroom with this figure and that was following me. Okay, well, Zach, Aaron, and Nick, I think you guys are crazy. We took the clip to a professional video analyst who specializes in video forensics. Hi, my name is Slim Ritchie. I'm a video analyst for 10 years now, and uh, we're going to take a look at this video to judge its authenticity and make sure it hasn't been altered in any way. See clearly right there, Nick is blocking the light. And they've got his legs where his legs are separated and where his legs are apart. And it looks like it's a uh, light from the outside coming in, as you can see, a uh, light behind Nick on his shoulders. And right there is the apparition as it's walking through. You can see it's uh, dimmed the light down a little bit as it's walking through the light. Right now I'm using specific editing tools uh, in an attempt to find any tampering or altering uh, that might have been done with the uh, original footage that's on these clips. The, the apparition figure here has not been overlaid or taken into the original footage. Uh, this can be seen with the vectorscope. If the, if the uh, image was altered in any way, um, I would see the transposed image here on the uh, screen. I did not notice any uh, altering or tampering with the original footage at all. <coughs> Greenspun Media's Las Vegas Weekly Magazine Sweet Jesus, are you good? February 2006 issue on page 35, Josh Bell.